vector equations are matrix equations. We defined linear dependence and independence in terms of vector equations. Let's now discuss these definitions in terms of matrix equations. And I'll dive right in with a theorem. Theorem. The equation AX equals zero has non-trivial solutions if and only if the columns of A are linearly dependent. And this theorem comes basically immediately from the definition of AX. Remember, if we think of A as a bunch of column vectors sitting next to each other, then AX is a linear combination of vectors like so. And the statement that AX equals zero is this vector equation. And now it is literally the definition of linear independence and linear dependence that this vector equation has non-trivial solutions if and only if the vectors are linearly dependent. This theorem is, I mean, you should know every theorem you're taught. This theorem is important because it ties stuff together. It relates matrix equations and vector equations, and it tells you how this new definition would be used in other contexts. I should emphasize, though, we don't need a theorem to tell us whether AX equals zero has non-trivial solutions. If that's all we're interested in, we can just use Gauss-Jordan elimination to solve this equation. So it's an interesting theorem, but if the question at hand is whether this equation has non-trivial solutions, it's probably not how you'd approach the question in practice. You'd probably use Gauss-Jordan elimination instead.